My name is Mrs. Young. I like to make videos to teach you new things and to help you remember the things you already know. I'm glad you're here today. Hi guys, how's everybody doing today? I hope you are all doing great. Today is Tuesday, March the 5th in the year 2024. So guys, if we look at our calendar, we have flipped the page and we are on a new month. Today is Tuesday, March the 5th in the year 2024. We haven't even had one full week of March yet. Let's talk about some of the holidays that are coming up and some of the things that are coming up in March. First of all, we have Daylight Savings Time, which begins again on March 10th. So that means that our clocks spring forward and we move them ahead one hour. And that means it's going to be darker in the morning and lighter later on into the evening. And then on March 17th, you better wear your green because you might get pinched. Because March 17th, Sunday, is St. Patrick's Day. So, happy St. Patrick's Day on the 17th. And the 31st is Easter Sunday. Sunday, March the 31st will be Easter. Okay, guys, so that's what's happening in March. Now, if you are in school or if you remember being in school, March is Music Education Month. So, today we're going to learn about musical instruments. Musical instruments are grouped into four different kinds of families. So, no matter what kind of music you like to listen to, country music, rap music, jazz music, rock music. There's some kind of musical instruments that are being played to make that music. So that is what we're going to learn about today. Okay, guys, are you ready? Here we go. An orchestra is a large group of musicians who play many different kinds of instruments that all make different sounds. The leader of the group of musicians is called the conductor. The instruments of the orchestra are split into groups. Brass instruments are made of metal. The musicians blow air through the mouthpiece and it makes a sound. Brass instruments also have buttons or valves. When a musician presses the buttons, the note and the sound will change. Some brass instruments are the trumpet, trombone, and tuba. Percussion instruments keep the beat. They make sounds when they are hit with sticks or small hammers. They can also be shaken and even scratched. Some percussion instruments are the drums, cymbals, triangle, chimes, tambourine, and xylophone. String instruments are made of wood and have strings. They make up most of the instruments in the orchestra. The musician moves the bow backward and forward across the strings or plucks the strings with their fingers. Some stringed instruments include the violin, viola, cello, bass, harp, and guitar. Woodwind instruments are long, hollow tubes, and they're either made of wood or metal. Hollow means there's nothing inside the tube. A woodwind instrument has a mouthpiece, which is either a hole or a small piece of wood called a reed. Sounds are made when the musician blows into the mouthpiece and the notes or sounds change when the musician opens or closes the holes with their fingers. Some wood instruments are the flute, piccolo, clarinet, and saxophone. The piano has strings that vibrate and hammers that strike the strings inside. So some people think that a piano is a string instrument and others say it is a percussion instrument. The musicians in an orchestra play a type of music called classical music, but instruments are used to play all other kinds of music as well. What kind of music do you like to listen to? Okay guys, so I want to see how much you remembered from our lesson, so it is quiz time. Okay, if I played the drums, would the drums be part of the brass family 
of musical instruments or would the drums be part of the percussion family of musical instruments? What do you think? If you said percussion instruments, you are right. Okay, let's do another one. If I played the guitar, would I be a part of the woodwind family of musical instruments? Or would I be a part of the string family of musical instruments? Now think about that. Guitar, what does a guitar have? If you said string instruments, you are right. Okay, one more. Are you ready? If I play the trumpet, would I be a part of the percussion family or would I be a part of the brass family? What do you think? If you said the brass family, you are right. Great job. All right, guys, so go listen to some music today, and I hope you have a great day. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I will see you next Tuesday in our next video. Bye.